and do something that's kind of like a stretch for me. I think I can do this. almost zero degree and I can even push my knee a little bit down and it wouldn't hurt me so much. Moving my ankle, yeah, I'm doing that pretty well too. Um, I also tried another thing today, which is try to tighten my, my quad muscle like that. So probably can't really see. Oh. This is my lunch. <laughs> It's been exactly 24 hours since my surgery and I'm already getting bored. I'm just so bored. I'm like here. I'm just like lying on this bed watching TV all the time. Ah, I'm starting to feel a little bit anxious. Wow, fried chicken. How do you guys feel about it? How do I started to feel the pain today, which is not very good. Wish me luck. Good morning. It's a Friday, day three after my surgery. Since last night, I started to feel the pain in my leg. It's not horrible, I just feel like nowadays I, f I don't want to move it so much anymore. <laughs> I feel like I'm a patient, I feel like I'm, <laughs> um, I'm definitely like not, not quite that good anymore. Uh, I'm watching Best Dress on YouTube, her name is Ashley, I really love her. So she's been keeping me entertained during my in bed time. So it's about time for me to do my exercises today and also just show you the signature leg that I got. Oh my god, my entire leg is full. So first thing is still extension. Like right now I'm doing very great. Without my brace and sitting on a hard floor, I'm able to, ex to fully extend my leg. I can even just push down my kneecap a little bit. And the other thing is also the quad um, exercise. Like I can still, it's still not like as much as I can do with my good leg, but like I'm, I'm moving my quad a little bit. Yeah. And the other thing I'm trying to throw in today because I'm feeling quite good is uh, I'm trying to passively move my leg a little bit. Like that. I'm gonna start using the CPM machine like after my post op, which is next Monday. So that will give me a lot more range of motion. But right now, I think I'm just gonna do a little bit of this every day to help it regain the range of motion. I feel so stupid. So I basically missed my post-op. I just feel so stupid. Hey everyone, it's Saturday. I noticed that every time I took one of the pain mad, which is um, oxycodone, apparently that's a very strong pain mad, I just become very dizzy or like sleepy and all that. I think it just really helps me to relax and <laughs> helps me not feel boring about doing anything. Um, I can easily see how that's addictive because it's basically just like, like drug. Alexa, turn on kitchen.
wasn't that bad. <laughs> I just want to briefly talk about like how hard it kind of gets for the past couple, two or three days. Yeah, it's been pretty hard. Like, the first thing that's hard is because every time I try to do something, it's uh, either uncomfortable or like even painful. And then the second thing is that you feel like you're so powerless. Like I used to do, I used to be able to like squat almost 200 pounds, like twice my weight. I used to be able to do box jumps and 100 burpees in 15 minutes and all those things and like right now, even just lifting one of my legs feels like 100 pounds it's really frustrating and It is really hard, but I know I have to do this. If I just sit comfort and sit in bed all day, that'll really delay my recovery. I wanted to do as much as I can to help my, my muscle regain their strength, help my knee regain the range of motion. So yeah, like it's hard to do the right thing sometimes. Finally, I'm out of this bed.
你说你现在找找什么？豆浆，我就想喝豆浆，觉得我也要喝豆浆，我